What is happening everyone? My name is Nick and you are watching this Friday edition of Peak Bites. For today's peaks, I'll be taking you around to some of the wonderful activities you can get out and do this weekend and potentially the rest of the season. We have a fun event for you to visit happening every Monday for you to get a taste of cultural diversity. I'll also be showing you an activity to hit up to keep your holiday stoke going. All that and more of course, so let's get into it. <laughs> We are lucky enough to have some amazing cultural diversity in the Salt Lake area. And even luckier that we have some awesome ways to celebrate that great cultural diversity. Mondays in the Park at Liberty Park is a great way to go out and celebrate our melting pot of cultural diversity, and it is happening every Monday. This event features a variety of traditional music and dance performances, all from a multitude of places. From South America to Mexico, Vietnam to India, this event will give you a great look into the arts of many different people. And you can witness all of these wonderful performances outside the Chase Home Museum in the beautiful Liberty Park. It is a bring your own seating event, but every performance and night is free and open to the public, so just bring a folding chair and you are good to go. You can visit artsandmuseums.utah.gov to see a full list of performances and when you can go see them. And we hope you get out and enjoy Mondays in the Park soon. If you didn't get enough fireworks and fun celebrations last week, then don't worry one bit. Jordanelle State Park is putting on their Fire on the Water event full of tons of excitement. Fire on the Water is pretty much exactly what it sounds like with a bunch of amazing pyrotechnics happening over our beautiful reservoir. But that's not all the fun stuff going on as they will have an entire afternoon of fun activities planned for you. The day will also include plenty of live music, some great local food trucks, and even a giant hot dog eating contest. Finally, there will also be a boat parade on the water before the fireworks show to cap off the night. Hop on over to the website at fireonthewater.com to see a full breakdown of the day's activities and to see about purchasing tickets. And we'll see you out enjoying this exciting event on Saturday. That is not the only thing going down this weekend, and to prove it to you, here are some fun things going on that you can join in on. Interactive Flick is putting on their Movie on the Water event, where you can go and float and be entertained by this Saturday's feature, The Meg. The Obon Japanese Festival is happening Saturday as well, hosted by the Salt Lake Buddhist Temple for you to get out and experience some authentic culture. For you fans of classic cinema, E.T. the Extraterrestrial will be played at Park City on Saturday night, accompanied by a live score performed by the Utah Symphony. And finally, Monster Truck Insanity is going down Saturday night at the Lehigh Roundup Rodeo for you to get your fix of huge entertainment. As always, I hope you have a fun and safe weekend enjoying some of these things. Well, that is all I have for you on Peak Bites today, but don't worry, we will be having political peaks coming up this Sunday. As always, follow us on social media at Park City TV to see what else we're up to, or check out our live stream at parkcity.tv happening 24 hours a day. Thank you so much for watching, and we will see you next time.